We're here with uh, Ken Hudnut uh, with the USGS, and he's going to talk to us a little bit about uh, soft story buildings and why um, and what is the issue with soft story buildings. Can you, Ken, can you um, sure. explain what's, what this is? There are a lot of these buildings all around, not just Southern California, but really all around the world. Uh, apartment buildings, for example, that have a, a rigid upper series of floors where people live. And then down on either the ground level or underground, they'll have these spindly small supports. You know the kind of buildings I'm talking about. There's so many of them around LA. A lot of newer buildings have a very sturdy ground floor for their parking, and those are fine. What we're talking about here is the older ones. So when an earthquake hits and you get the violent shaking, you can see how uh, that weak structure on the first floor is just flimsy and that's a real problem. And you can even get a collapse. Like this is what happened in the Marina District in 1989, Loma Prieta earthquake, the buildings at the street corners lurched out like this, and in some cases even covered up fire hydrants, which exacerbated the problem. So what we want to do is stiffen up a structure like this. It's not that hard, it's not that expensive, and it can even be done while people are living in the building. But imagine putting in some supports just like this in this model, and here you're just strengthening it up, and by doing that, you can really prevent a lot of damage in the future. So there are a number of companies around that specialize in doing these seismic retrofits. And so the idea is to uh, have a program, it's now mandatory in the city of Los Angeles to stiffen up the structure. So you can see how if the ground shakes now, the building is much more rigid. And that's the whole idea of it, is to just stiffen up that first story. So instead of a soft first story, now you've got a rigid first story. The whole thing is going to ride through a future earthquake much better.